this really pretty weather today. It's really nice, very sunny, and the birds are singing. In today's video, as you can tell by the title, this is a nymphatic basics for your room, I guess, like to get a more. I mean, there's different kind of um, nymphid rooms, I would say. I'm looking through like nymphid rooms on like, I don't know, if you look at pictures or something, if you Google it, or if you're on Pinterest or something. There's rooms like Dolores Hayes had in the Lolita movie. There's rooms like mine, a little dreamy-ish. There's a little more 80s room. There's like different, there's also like dark rooms, you know, nymphid inspired rooms. I'm gonna show you some or tell you some, um, in my opinion, that would be more nymphed, basic nymphed things for your room. I don't know what to call my room, it's a little dreamy, cute, you know? You tell me down below because I'm not sure, but let's just get started. You can put up whatever poster you want, basically. It can be a celebrity crush or posters from the movie Lolita or posters from, I don't know, Virgin Suicide, that movie. Usually it's like celebrities that you have a crush on <laughs> uh, or like movie posters, maybe even music. I guess that would be the first thing or like one of the things. The second thing is little decoration things. I think they're so cute. I usually have angels and it's either blue, pink, white or gold. If you want to make your nymph room, you should pick out some colors that you really like and put it into your room because some people find it difficult to find things for their room. So maybe picking some colors would make it easy. For example, I have pink, blue, gold, white and, you know, a little brownish. You should pick out your colors that you like and put it into your room, I guess. There's a lot of those at the thrift store um, and it's usually easier to find something cute and vintage looking if you're out for that in the thrift store, uh, which I found most of my decoration things. The third thing would be fake flowers or just flowers. Um, fake flowers in my opinion, is really cute. Fake flowers is, you know, you don't have to take care of them. Um, and flowers usually die easily, like roses or stuff. They die, like, very quickly. Or even, what are they called? Garlands? I, I might be totally wrong. I don't have those, but I have some in my Amazon wish list. <laughs> but it, it could be cute, like, hanging on your mirror, maybe, like, you know, around it, where you have your curtains at the window you can kind of you know or your door anywhere if you if you like the look of flowers the fourth is it the fourth yeah i think it is would be like curtains and sheets i don't know how to explain it but i have as you know i have my little makeup table or whatever um and i have those sheets and stuff hanging if you're looking for this dreamy cute style i would definitely recommend having some cute curtains or you know sheets or you know something like that it's very easy to find as well at the thrift store fifth thing would be fairy lights any lights i mean especially fairy lights another one in my on the roof in my ceiling yeah kind of in my ceiling um that's different colors but i prefer the ones that just are you know just normal lights. Small ones are very cute. You can hang them anywhere. You can hang, hang them where your curtains are, put them here like I have. I, they're not on now. I should have maybe put them on for the video. <laughs> or on your mirror, which I have. On your wall. Around your door frame. Anything, like anything, it's cute. Fairy lights or lights in general. It's great. The sixth Thing, cute bed sheets. It makes a lot for your room, in my opinion. I usually have my just normal white sheets because I like when it looks clean, and then I have some um, pillow sheets. I'm not sure what it's called, but you know what I mean. 
some pattern or flowers. I usually have flowers. I put like a blanket or a sheet over the bed that's also in a pattern or flowers if I have just white bed sheets, which is really cute. Having some sort of bed sheets, usually it's flowers, at least for me. I like flowers. It depends on your theme and your room, I guess. And then just like some things to add. Cute mirror, you know those little makeup mirrors, candles, stuffies. For me, I have a record player. Maybe you could put up your records, LP records, vinyls, maybe on your wall or just put them somewhere to make it a little cute. You've already seen my room tour, so maybe that will give you some inspiration. If you haven't, by the way, um, check the description and I will link it down below or here. I think it's up here. Yeah, that is it for this little video, a little basics um, room, dreamy-ish, whatever. If you don't really have this style of the room, like dreamy-ish, you can just kind of pick out some stuff if you like it. That's it for this video, I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, hit the like button, and if you have any other Nymphida videos, requests that you want me to make, tell me down below, and I read every single comment, and... Please leave, a like. Please leave a like if you like it, it'll help me out a lot. And if you're not subscribed already, click the little subscribe button. And if you are subscribed but you haven't clicked the notification button, post notification, um, you should definitely do that so you will be notified when I post a video because some people actually miss it. To help me out, you could do that and it will be very appreciated. Thank you for watching and I will see you tomorrow. I love you, bye.